What's up YouTube, this is Dragon and this is another Pokemon Wi-Fi battle. So let's get to the battle at hand. Well, with this team, I'm going to say that the most troublesome Pokemon is probably going to be the Blaziken because the Blaziken, you never know what it's going to turn into. It could be a Mega Blaziken, it could be a regular Blaziken, who knows what type of Blaziken it's going to be. And speaking of that, you know, I just pressed B for my Pokemon, so hopefully, uh, okay, good. So, my Crobat still came out first. That's good. So, now my opponent chose Swampert first. So, hopefully, and ironically, hopefully, my opponent evolves into Mega Swampert. Because, well, you know, I don't want to really deal with too much of that type of insanity. So, what I'm going to do, I'm going to U-turn right here. I'm going to U-turn into my... Okay, let's see. Okay, he didn't evolve, so... I will either U-turn into my Noivern or into my Conkelder. I think it would be more wise if I were to U-turn into my Conkelder. I know he's probably going to go for the water attack or maybe the rocks. And... Actually... Let me see. Yeah. I'm going to go into my... No, I need my Conkelder for the Electric-type Pokemon. So... Yes. I'm going to go into my Norvern. I'm going to take a bit of a risk. And instead, you know, I could be getting hit with a nice punch. Hopefully my opponent just goes for the... Okay, goes to the Stealth Rock. Alright, nice and stealthy. Okay, so now... I'm debating on whether I should go either for the Boom Burst or the Draco Meteor. Because my opponent could just switch in and then, you know, that'd be that. I know Draco Meteor is probably not going to kill this Pokemon right off the bat. So... I'm gonna go for the Hurricane instead. The Hurricane can do some decent damage regardless. And will my opponent switch? I just gotta hope that Hurricane hits. That's pretty much the only clause in the situation. Yeah, Hurricane pretty much hits the whole team, and you know, even if he switches, he still does a lot of damage regardless. And Hurricane, I, I miss. Scald. Ah, uh, come on. Well, it's not gonna be very effective, hopefully. I does not get the burn. Not bad. Alright, so now I have another chance to use Hurricane. And, oh, Jesus Christ, man. Freaking A. Uh, yes, yes, of course. He goes to the Crobat. Alright, so now I'm gonna have to Brave Bird because I'm in, I'm pretty much forced. Man, I needed to hit those two Hurricanes, man. I really did. So, either he's going to use a water attack or he's going to go for the Scald. Scald would be a pretty good play. But, a double Brave Bird should be able to finish off this Pokemon. Oh, it's Citrus Berry. Uh, man, this this is just... Ah, uh, well, at least he roared me, so... Alright. And Conkelder. Alright. Not bad. I'm glad I didn't really get... I mean, I guess I could have just went for the Draco Meteor at that point. But now I'm going to go for the Drain Punch. And hopefully he does Scald me. That's good. Hopefully the Scald burns me. I really hope it does. And good. Got the burn. So now I'm most likely going to be able to kill him with this Drain Punch. Not bad. Ah, oh, the crit. Don't really think that was needed. I'm not sure. I mean, it was a plus one Drain Punch. And he had minimal health. And Conkelder does have a lot of attack power, like 400 and something. Like 408 or 410, so I don't really think that was completely necessary. Alright, so now, man, I, I really wish I had those Hurricanes. But, you know, they turned out pretty nicely. Wasn't that much damaging to me. And I'm, I'm glad my opponent went for the Roar instead of the, you know, anything else. Oh, wow, this is interesting. Because I'm burned, so... I could just go straight for the Drain Punch right off the bat here and uh, not have to worry about being put to sleep. So, okay, Bullet Seed. Oh my goodness, I have a crazy cold right now. Okay, that's two. Yeah, only hit twice. Not bad. <coughs> um, and there's the Focus Sash. Alright. So now... I have a strong feeling my opponent, well, he might go for the Drain Punch, I'm not sure. 
I'm definitely gonna go for the drink, uh, Mott Punch. So... Oh, nope. All right, so that was also my next fear, was this Pokemon right here. Um, not really much of a problem anymore, because it's pretty much gone. Oh man, this cold, cold is driving me crazy. All right, good. This is the po this is the Pokemon that I feared the most, honestly. Okay, so I'm obviously gonna go for the Drain Punch here. All right, cause this Pokemon has Hidden Power, Ice, and Thunderbolt. Basically, if I don't kill this Pokemon, ooh, Intimidate. If I don't kill this Pokemon right here, right now, then uh, pretty much it's over. And Thunderbolt does not do enough. And there we go. Oh, critical hit. I still had the Mock Punch, so, you know, wasn't really that big of a deal. And if I really wanted to go there, I could have just switched out, got rid of the Intimidate, and that would have been it. You know, I would have been at plus one again, so, you know, it, it was win-win in that situation. I actually got kind of lucky now that I'm thinking about it. I'm glad my opponent roared me out because I got roared into the Conk Elder. Instead, I would have been stuck with some other Pokemon, or maybe I never would have been scalded. So, hey, you know, it turned out to be in my favor. So, yeah, that's how battles go, man. You know, you think that one thing isn't really good for you, but the next thing you know, it actually causes you to win the match. I might have lost if it weren't for that. You could have put my con counter to sleep, and then who knows what would have happened at that point. But nonetheless, it was still a great game, and I'm glad that you enjoyed this battle. Well, I will see you in the next one. See you later.